everyone. I'm Nat Heitman. We're here for a holiday drink taste test. Hey. Uh, I haven't. I usually drink coffee every morning. I'm a coffee drinker, but I don't usually drink sweet stuff anymore. That was middle school Nat Heitman. So <laughs> I'm looking to see if these flavors are going to be interesting to me today. Yeah, um, I'm Helena. I'm not a coffee drinker whatsoever, so this is going to be very interesting. Although if I do drink coffee, it's definitely towards the sweeter side. I'm still middle school Nat Heitman, but yeah. <laughs> I'm Sophie Plotkin, and at this point, my blood is mocha. That's all there is to it. If you were to eat gingerbread and then put water in your mouth at the same time oh. and then drink it, it's like watered down. I don't really get the same like, sugar. There's no crunch to yeah. it. And Honestly, this is. if you want to make this at home, you probably just have to soak gingerbread in coffee for a little <laughs> you bit. You could just, yeah. Dump a bunch of milk in yeah. it. Yeah. And that, that's if someone gave this as a gift to me on Christmas, I would be extremely disappointed. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I would like, feel I, so I was, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully my parents are watching and they know what not yeah. to get me. Good. Eggnog's like the classic Christmas drink. Yeah, that's So this is really like the most important test for Starbucks. Yeah. Oh my god. It smells awful. Also, it I smells just... like pure sugar. And eggs. Mm. Cheers. Right. Oh. Oh. Mm. It's all right. I can I'm... I can say that it definitely tastes like eggnog. So yeah. So good job, Starbucks. What mm. kind of person would like this? You have your three kids. You're exhausted. You make it to Starbucks. You just right. feel so alone. So like single so... mom or soccer mom syndrome, where you go to Starbucks <laughs> in the morning before work, and you're like. You have to have your coffee every day, otherwise your three kids are going to just drain you. Um, <laughs> yeah. But you come and you're like, hey, I haven't had time to go to Stop and Shop and get eggnog. Why not just get my coffee, but with, with eggnog, eggnog infused? Yeah. If someone got me this for a gift, I would drink it. I would dump it in their lap. But I still wouldn't be very happy about <laughs> Okay. <it>. Not, <laughs> not about this life. Cheers. 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 Oh. That's foam. disappointing. Yeah, that was foam. I definitely feel like I'm eating a pine tree, like a little bit. A little it bit? tastes a little bit like the smell of pine, but in my mouth. Like what I imagine a car freshener would taste like. Like the first thought I have is disappointing, but then the yeah. first thing I think of when I think of disappointing is myself. Ooh. So. Oh, gonna... <laughs> me as a coffee? <laughs> yeah. On a scale of like, yay to eh, it's this is solidly meh. meh. Yeah. Yeah, right in the middle. Oh, this is the really drink you, good. this is the drink you should have made. Yeah. I want um, this for Christmas. You've got like your all around. It's like yeah. high school, senior year, you get voted best all around. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> you're not really good at any one of the things, but together you're good at like a lot of different things. Yeah. So, you okay. were very well-rounded. Well this is a very well, well-rounded well -rounded. So, child. They would apply to drink. Ivy Leagues, but I, they would end up at a state school. I feel they like. would drink yeah. or to apply to like Northeastern. That's like yeah. a good chance. Mm -hmm. Even UMass Amherst, you know. Yeah, I mean. They're very well-rounded. They're clearly good at like a, they're good at like a lot of different things, but like they haven't really picked one thing they want to focus on. They want I to like I am this college. drink. <laughs> they're directly. <laughs> they're not sure what kind of major. Not sure what kind of major. Like after spending their years at whatever state school, this is like the grandma that lives by the elementary school. They hang out. You see her every now yeah. and then, but then like all of a sudden when you get older, she starts leaving out like the cookies to. To, to like draw you in. To draw <laughs> you well, no, Where's this going? He's out on the windowsill to like um, let them, you know, air out. And you walk up and you try to take one. She catches you and you think she's gonna be like really, really mad. But she's like, oh no, oh, you can take yeah, as many as you want. And then she's like, becomes your best friend. Like it grows on you. It's like a slit. Like at first you're kind of like terrified of her and you don't know what to expect. But then you talk to her a couple times and she like, Let's you get away with not having a pass once or twice, and then, and then this all is of what you get, and it's great. Yeah, it's friends. awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Unexpected, but awesome. Sorry. Starbucks. You did a bad job. Side yeah, note. Yeah, I know. Mm. We love you. Uh, I do. These are terrible. Mm.